Were you there during the whole making of Reasonable Doubt? Uh, for the most part, yeah. Were you there when uh, Biggie and Jay-Z made uh, Brooklyn's Finest with Clark Kent? Um, for a couple of, what is that section? Yeah. So you were there? Mm-hmm. Um, did you know Biggie at that point? Yeah, but I, I, knew, I knew Big before that. Yeah, that's what I meant. I, yeah. So you already knew who he was. Um, no, nah, I actually no. Nah, when, when I when I met Big, or not even like a formal meet, when I used to run into him, like I didn't I didn't know of him as a a rap artist or MC or none of that. Um, when I first um, gotten back from from London, three weeks after coming back to Marcy, I moved out of Marcy and moved into like Clinton Hills area. And, uh, and you know, Big lived around there, you know, over there, like Clawson, St. James. Mm -hmm. um, and so um, my cousin, one of my cousins, he had moved up with me, you know, so he was rooming with me. Um, and, you know, I, I wasn't working, you know, I was, you know, I finished my album and, you know, was just living, writing at my leisure. Everything was leisure. So every day when the weather was nice, I come out and we shoot ball. There was a park on the corner of um, Clawson and um, Clawson and Fulton. And um, Big and a couple of his people, you know, they used to be in the park. And, um, you know, one day he approached me. He was like, you think nobody know who you are? I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. Yeah. So like, that's what's up. So after that, you know, you know, just see him, say what's up. Me yeah. and my cousin just continue shooting ball. Well, you know, we, we interviewed Lil C's recently. And uh, he said that Big felt that Jay-Z was better than him. Yo, did Big ever tell you he felt like Jay was nicer than him? Yeah. Hell yeah. He said that shit before. So he actually said that? Yeah. You know, that was like one of the only rappers that he felt that way about. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, from your point of view, knowing both of them, who, who do you think was the better rapper? Jay-Z. <laughs> you? <laughs> there you go. Good answer. Um, <laughs> but but um, in everybody's defense, like, Everybody's supposed to say when asked that if you're not saying that you're the best, right? But I'm saying Biggie actually felt that yeah, Jay Z that's was what I'm better than him. Yeah, I, I and Biggie's considered one of the best ever, is what I'm saying. Right, and that that was very, Humble. no pun intended, very big of him. Yeah, to to do and say that. Um, but in his defense, I feel like. Um, Nobody can be who you are. Like, so you're the best you, yeah. you know, um, from, from my standpoint for the things that I look for in lyrics, of course, I would say, I would say Jay-Z is more skilled, Okay. but somebody else who has a different understanding on what, what's, what they want to hear. So it's all opinionated. Yeah. No. They will obviously say like, well, I like Big better because the thing about Big was he would say he would say things that like I would never say. Yeah. You know, and it's not that I didn't I wouldn't I can't think of it. I just won't say that shit. Right. You know, like, <laughs> you, look you know, so like good. this so fun. I, I suck, suck a daddy's, daddy's dick. dick. There's yeah, no, no way I, in I, the I fucking say world. That either, right. <laughs> you know, and I'm not, you know, and there's no disrespect to him, but, you know, if he was still here today, I would tell him. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I'm not feeling that lyric. Right. Fair yeah, enough. Yeah. I was uh, like. Oh, OK. And that and that probably won him a lot, you know, because that's an, it's an old saying. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it yeah, probably won Pryor him a lot of accolades. Yeah. Exactly.